Hello, I'm Tom Nickel, the Lead Technical Marketing Engineer at Winova. One of the greatest challenges to any IT organization is lost, broken, or stolen laptops. The Panamon Institute, in conjunction with Intel, estimates that each lost laptop can cost an organization up to $50,000 each time when all factors are taken into consideration. Winova's Mara software can help drastically reduce the cost of a lost, broken, or stolen laptop. Let's find out how. We'll start with our end user Bill, who is in a pretty common scenario for any sales professional. Bill is at home in San Jose, getting ready to leave for the airport. He's got a short customer engagement this afternoon in Los Angeles, and he'll be back tomorrow morning. Before he leaves, he has to make some quick modifications to a sales spreadsheet for a conference call that he'll be taking from the airport lounge before he boards. Bill inputs some of the new sales data into his spreadsheet, and when he is done, he'll click Save and then close Excel. Now he's going to run upstairs to pack, then leave for the airport in about an hour. While he's packing upstairs, Mirage will automatically sync the changes Bill just made to his spreadsheet with the corporate data center. You see, the Mirage software keeps a virtual copy of every end user's endpoint in the data center. This copy includes their user files, like Bill's spreadsheet, as well as their user personalizations and user applications. All of these pieces get synced up automatically with their virtual copy back in the data center. It is also worth noting that Mirage will also only transfer the files that are new or have been modified back to the data center during these automatic syncs. This feature, which we call deduplication, saves a tremendous amount of time and bandwidth. Let's get back to Bill, who has just arrived at the airport a little late. Unfortunately, in his haste, he dropped his laptop at the security checkpoint. When he got to the airport lounge, he realized that his laptop wasn't booting anymore, and he needs to access his sales spreadsheet for the meeting which is coming up in 30 minutes. But now, Bill is left with only his smartphone and the tablet for the duration of his business trip. Bill calls his IT manager, Ted, in a panic, but Ted is able to ease Bill's fears. Let's see how. First, Ted informs Bill that because Mirage keeps a complete copy of his endpoint in the data center, he can access all of his user data from his smartphone or tablet while he is away. All he has to do is open the web browser on his device, log in to the Mirage file portal, and open up the file he needs to access. This is great news for Bill, who has a sales conference call coming up in about 30 minutes. He'll simply pull up the sales spreadsheet on his tablet and dial into the call via his smartphone. But what about the fact that his laptop is still broken? What can Ted do about that? Let's find out. Ted has been working behind the scenes to replace Bill's broken laptop by the time Bill returns from his trip tomorrow morning. In our previous video, Total Endpoint Recovery Using Winova Mirage, we showed you how Ted restored a user's image to a VM for temporary access before he restored the user's image to a new laptop. Since Ted now keeps a few replacement laptops available at all times for situations just like this, there is no need to restore Bill's image to a VM for temporary access. Instead, Ted can quickly restore Bill's image directly to Bill's new laptop and have Bill access that new laptop remotely via his tablet. After Ted got off the phone with Bill, he grabbed one of the boxes off the shelf, booted up the new laptop, and installed the small 2 megabyte Mirage client on it. All this laptop has now is Windows 7 and the Mirage client. Ted then logged in to his Mirage management console. This is where Ted manages all of the endpoints that are registered to this Mirage system, including the replacement laptop for Bill that Ted just booted up. Recall that Mirage has an exact copy of every endpoint stored in the data center, including Bill's. Ted is going to take that copy from the data center and apply it to this new replacement laptop with just a few clicks in the Mirage management console. Glancing over at Bill's replacement laptop, Ted can open up the Mirage client window and see that the copy of Bill's endpoint is now being downloaded from the data center and onto this replacement laptop. To accomplish this, Mirage uses integrated network deduplication technology, which ensures that only the data that doesn't already exist on this laptop will be transferred over. This means that instead of sending an entire 15 gigabyte Windows image down, we're only sending the missing pieces. In this case, the copy of Bill's endpoint and this replacement laptop both share a plethora of Windows files. Since those files already exist on the replacement laptop, there is no need to transfer those Windows files across the network from the data center. Instead, we'll just leverage those files as is, 
and only transfer the files that are different or don't already exist on this replacement endpoint. Because of these technologies, Bill's replacement will be ready by the time he arrives at the customer's site in a few hours. The replacement laptop is ready to go. All of Bill's user personalizations, applications, and files have been downloaded back to this new laptop. Even the changes he made to his sales spreadsheet hours ago will persist onto this new replacement laptop. And we can see in our transaction log that this entire restoration process only took about 15 minutes, and the amount of data that actually got transferred was only around 250 megabytes. These savings are a direct result of Mirage's storage and network deduplication technologies. Bill has just landed in Los Angeles, and he's reviewing his messages on his tablet. He sees an email from Ted about his replacement laptop. Ted explains that Bill's replacement laptop has been completely restored and is ready for him to pick up tomorrow morning when he returns. But Ted also explains that he's enabled remote connections by Bill to the replacement laptop and set it up in the data center so Bill can connect to it while he's on site with the customer. Bill wants to test this out, so he launches the remote connection app on his tablet, enters the IP that Ted provided, and logs in with his Active Directory credentials. His desktop appears on his tablet, and he immediately recognizes everything. Bill is delighted to see that this is a complete replica of his broken laptop. And Bill will now be able to do all of his work from his replacement laptop that resides in San Jose via his tablet from Los Angeles, without experiencing any user downtime or user data loss.